What is going on everybody? It is Kratone and I'm bringing you guys another Fortnite Battle Royale video and today is a little bit of a different topic. Um, but real quick, I just want to say I got my first solo win on PC last night. It was pretty lit, not even going to lie. Anyway, um, but I just I want to go over why I this topic that I'm thinking of, uh, just why I think it's happening and why, like, just my personal opinion on it. Um, but also, real quick, if you guys are brand new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. Make sure to leave a like down below if you enjoy this and agree. Um, but our main topic for today is that the fact that Fortnite Battle Royale is not fun anymore. Um, and my, my, my personal opinion on it, I think the reason it's not fun anymore is that Fortnite's only worried about money. Like Epic Games, that's all they're worried about is money and just getting new skins out there um like i think one of the biggest problems in my personal opinion is ghost hit markers which i think are going to be coming in the most uh in this next patch um in the next couple days um and I i'm i'm really hoping that that gets fixed um because i may like i'm a big fan of this game i have been since release it's one of my favorite games of all time but if they don't fix things fast, there's going to be some problems, and I don't think a lot of people are going to want to play this game. Um, but like, with the, just a bunch of problems in the game, I think, are what are causing the game to not be as fun anymore. And even like streaming has become not even fun for me anymore. I I, I like streaming, but I stream pretty pretty much every single day for three to four hours and it, it's hard for me to uh, not that I I mean I get like maybe five viewers at most every stream and that's that's like my max don't get me wrong it's awesome I love having people in there but I stream every single day and the fact that I can't pull more than five viewers is a little bit upsetting um, and especially on this game because everybody streams this game and people only want to watch like the top five people that, that that's really it um, and that, that's honestly why I think the game is because everybody's a TTV or everybody is... No, don't get me wrong, I have TTV in my name. But everybody's a TTV or everybody is just an absolute tryhard using a soccer skin or playing on stretch res. And I think that... Not just that, but it's... Like, they need to fix that, honestly. That's, that's one of the other things I think it's... Like, they just need to fix stretch res. I think it looks stupid. That's just something small that I want to talk about. Um, and I honestly could say that the game would be so much better if it wasn't, if it didn't have so, an, as much of a toxic community. Um, you guys can feel free to agree or disagree. Um, but it, it's just the small things, honestly. Um, and it's just it's different honestly this game used to be so much more it, i mean it was just it was way different way different like i got on and actually enjoyed the game when it was like a few months ago I actually got on and enjoyed and I, I still get on i still enjoy the game but after a while it just it gets very very tilting um and a lot of people don't understand why um, like I said, like, just emotes, toxic players, um, the fact that they, they, not that they favor idiots, but the, the game doesn't, like, the, they're just not listening to their pro community. They want to favor the kids who can't get wins and stuff like that, which is understandable. Everybody wants to get, everybody wants to win, everybody wants to have fun, but they need to cater to their pros and fix problems first then they can not not really like cater to people but they need to just be able to i, I guess you could say um I mean, oh my lord um they, like, not i don't know, I know what i'm trying to say not really cater to people but just listen to what people have to say and take ideas and then go from there i, I think that's what i'm trying to say um if they did that their company would i think in my personal opinion would be a lot more successful um so we'll see how that plays out. Um, 
and a purple AK as well. Oh my lord. What are you doing, Epic? You're giving me everything. Usually this doesn't happen. Now watch me die, though. Um, but like I said, I don't have as much fun as I did. So, like I said, that, that could just be me, personally. But we'll see. Um, if Just let me know what you guys' honest opinions are on Fortnite thus far. Um, season 7 is like, pretty much halfway over. Um, we still have about five weeks left to go. And we're going to see what they can fix. Um, they've vaulted a lot of things that people enjoy. Um, some of them needed to be vaulted and some things need to be nerfed still. Like, I think that's one of the reasons why it's not as fun anymore. Um, but I think, I think they're focusing on small problems instead of big problems. Um, and I, that's one of the reasons why I think so many people have gone away from this game. Um, and not and never return and if they do it's maybe for a game to see how it goes and if it th they feel that it still hasn't changed then they don't they don't want to play simple as that I, I mean I could sound completely stupid but I, I think that's my personal opinion and I think that's what changes the game and makes the game fun is different things and stuff like that but they need to fix the problems that way other people can come back to their game and their game will be more enjoyable. Like, I just, and, and the looting table was too crowded. I'm glad they vaulted the burst. Um, like, the, those are some, some steps in the right direction. But I feel like there's a lot of other things that need to be fixed as well. Um, I need, like, a rift or something. They won't have to find another way down. Um, so... Oh, this is that stupid chest. It's right here. Bro. Um, so just let me know you guys' personal opinions of what, what do you think. Another purple gun, dude. Holy crap. Freaking, I've gotten bursts. I've gotten the heavy AR. I have literally gotten anything and everything. Pump? Gold pump. No. Another shield though, I will take that. Alright, this is going to be a risky play, folks. This is going to be a very risky play. But we're going to see if it works out. Here we go, folks. Here we go, folks. Hmm. Well, I'm going to be completely honest. That did not go as planned. And a person like this has two kills. Th this is what I talk about, guys. Like, they, they Fortnite favors players like this. I understand they're new to the game, or they just aren't very good. But Fortnite caters to people like this, who stay out in the middle of nowhere, they continue to, I mean, this person could be lagging, but they continue to swing, they hide in bushes, they wait till last minute in the game to get a kill and do whatever. And those are the people that win and get kills. Why? I don't know. And there's like a bunch of things that still haven't been fixed, such as shotgun shots. I mean, I yesterday I played and dropped on top of somebody. I didn't stream yesterday, but I dropped on top of somebody with a gold pump and did 22 damage. Close range. I've never had that happen. Of course, I was above him, so maybe I missed a few pellets, but it was it was a bit ridiculous. Um, but those are some of the main points, honestly, guys. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to drop a thumbs up. I'm just I was just messing around really in a game. Um, but when this video is live, I'll be live on Twitch, so make sure to drop a follow, come on by the stream, I'll be live, we'll be playing. Um, but I, I appreciate the support, so thank you all so much for watching, and uh, yeah, appreciate it guys. Like I said, if you guys agree, let me know. Make sure to drop a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll talk to you later. Thank you guys. Peace.